we're off to the races and today is the opening of Rito's winter racing season. Nine on your sides, Natalie Taranjoli is there live with more on today's turnout and what we can expect for the rest of the season. Natalie. Hey Taja, there was a huge turnout for the first day today at the Rito racetrack. The seventh race of the day just wrapped up behind me. These are some ponies. They lead the race horses and we're waiting for the eighth and final race of the day to start in about 20 minutes. But back to that turnout. Let me show you the crowd that is still here. It's been overcast guys today, but no rain. Very big turnout and they expect it to continue throughout the season. Now the birthplace of quarter horse racing, the Rito racetrack now in its 76th season. Each weekend you can catch live quarter horse and thoroughbred racing action. The racetrack's general manager says the town really comes out for horse racing in Tucson, locals and snowbirds alike. He calls it a big event at a small track every day. It's a lot of fun. I mean, you've got a sport here. You have professional athletes. I have like to use the line where you have, uh, you know, 115-pound athletes during a 1,200-pound athlete going 35 miles an hour. The last race is set to start in about 20 minutes, like I mentioned. Now, races will continue here tomorrow. It'll go every weekend through mid-March. Every day, the first race will start here at 1.30. Taja? And Natalie, the Rito Racetrack is partnering with the University of Arizona this year for student internships, right? That's right. It's a brand new program. It just launched. They're partnering with the U of A's uh, College of uh, Agriculture and Life Sciences. It's brand new. We'll tell you all about it tonight on Kega 9 at 10. For now, reporting live from the Rito Racetrack, Natalie Taranjoli, Kega 9 on your side.